Hey everyone, this is Abel in Vegas coming to you with a quick video. Um, the other day, um, Eric, those back pages, uh, did a quick video asking, inquiring about the various um, video equipment that we use uh, for our YouTube videos. So now it's been a less than a year for me doing videos, but if you go back to my original um, videos, I actually used to shoot those right off the camera off my laptop. Uh, but unfortunately, that laptop for me is getting close to 10 years old, I believe. I bought it either in 2008 or I think it was more 2010, but I can't remember. So um, I really don't even have that much space on it anymore. Um, it's very slow, but it works good for uploading videos. Uh, but that's about, that's about it. So when I was thinking about going back and starting to do videos again, I actually did research on what other YouTubers were using. And so while other people use um, DSLRs, uh, which I do have one because I like shooting photographs, um, there's also GoPro cameras. I have one of those as well. Uh, but I didn't go with those just because the DSLR that I have is very bulky. It's pretty big. And the GoPro really is meant more for like action shots. Um, the way the um, lens is designed with the GoPro, it's more like a bubble effect. So it's, it's a very wide angle lens. So it really didn't work for what I wanted to do for YouTube. So the camera that I chose to go with was one of the cameras that's actually very popular um, among YouTube users. And that is the Canon uh, G7X. So what I like about this camera, as you can see, I could hold it in my hand. Oops, and I just pressed the button. Um, but then when you turn on, the lens comes out. And then it has a cool lens on the back as well. And then it flips up. So if I wanted to, um, I could shoot front and I could see what's going on. Um, I believe there's also an app, but I haven't downloaded it yet. Um, so uh, the reason I went with this one also was because while the editing piece wasn't as wasn't as important to me, what was more important was the video quality. And I believe this one is 24 megapixels, I believe, for the lens. Um, so I think hopefully this summer, one of my goals is to update um, my computer, either getting um, an iPad. Mac Mini, a Mac, a Mac, or no, a new updated MacBook Pro, or just a Mac, a desktop Mac. Uh, but once I do that, then I'll be able to get the space, the memory, to then do more of the editing. Uh, but for now, just to be able to shoot. Um, another reason why I like this one too is because if I want to decide to do vlog something, it is very compact. I can hold it in my hand. Um, I have a cool little. Hold on one second. I have this cool little thing that just pops up. I can hold it in my hand and hold the camera to move it around. So it's very neat. So you'll see me. I'll carry. I'll be carrying this with me at the national. Um, and then the other thing too for um, battery, um, the app, the the battery um, recharges just on the phone. On, on the, I'm sorry, on the camera, but it actually I'm able to hook it up to my battery pack. So if I do need to re recharge this, I could do it on the go. Um, I don't have to worry about taking the battery out, plugging it in. So there you go, Eric. That is what I chose for a camera. Um, the other one I do recommend, if if you want to use it, I think the video quality is very high definition. That is actually the new iPhone um, 10, um, the iPhone which is shooting right now. Mine's the 6S. Um, and it's paid off, so I didn't want to go back into paying for another phone again. So that's why I haven't upgraded my phone, but um, if that was an option. The other option I was thinking about getting as well, if you want options, is the new iPad, uh, the, the iPad mini. I have thought about getting that, and the new version just came out within the last week. But I haven't finished doing my research. I still want to go and compare the cameras between the iPad mini and the iPhone X um, to see if that was an option 
um, to hold me off from now until um, I get um, the MacBook um, or up update my computer. So, because I do like what, like Pepino Man does very good editing um, on his videos. Um, I like um, Baseball Collector, Mike. He also does, you know, where he begins the video showing his, um, talking to you guys and then flipping it over to show the cards. Like, I would like to do more of that. But right now, I just like to shoot the videos in one take just because of the camera and not having the editing capabilities on my laptop. So that is why um, I went with that camera. So it gives you guys some high quality video. Um, but, you know, eventually I'll get to the editing piece. So hopefully that helps you in making a decision about if you're looking at upgrading um, your equipment. So anyway, thanks and have a good day.